All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're looking at the Tesla Model Y. We have some cool accessories for it. These are some sunshade blackout kit. This can black out all of the windows in the Model Y. And I want to show you guys how this works. This is from a company called Test Launch. They've partnered with us on this video here. So I want to show you each of these pieces. You can see here we have all the pieces laid out here. So starting from the back, we have this is the rear window. These two pieces here are the, the roof. This, the roof in the Model Y is all glass. And so this is a two-piece full glass roof cover. And then we have these small little triangular pieces. These are for the back windows right here. We've got a piece right here for this window. And then this, these foldable windows here are for the side windows. We have a windshield cover. And then it comes with bags. Now, just I want to tell you guys, this is, uh, this is actually a combination of two sets or two kits. The, the, roof panel, the roof panels kind of come as their own set. And then all of the other windows come as their own set. So this is kind of a combination of two sets. I'll leave a link down below to, the, to this set. This would be a great solution. Let's say if you're, you're camping or you're storing your car or you just want to have some privacy in there. You know, you don't want to have any sun in there. This is really going to kind of black out, keep all the sun, full privacy kit for the car. So let's get into the car. I'm going to show you exactly how they fit, how the fit and finish is, and show you how it looks uh, as we get them in. So we're going to put on the the windshield cover first and the outside piece is going to be this this silver metallic uh, material here it's going to help reflect the uv light it's going to really help keep it a lot cooler so it's nice to just have this especially if you're keeping your car outside for any kind of period of time let's say you're going to work or something it'll go uh, you can just put this up like like this and then just velcros around the rearview mirror these also because they're kind of this thin metal material they actually fold up into smaller packages and they will uh, more easily store in those bags so we got the windshield one there we can it, this even stays up stays up pretty well even without the sun you don't have to have the sun visors you can put the sun visors down to keep it up but it really fits all the corners really well so most of the entire windshield is covered with this so this has a nice fit to it we're going to try the uh, driver and passenger side front windows and we'll kind of work our way back. So here's the, this is the driver and passenger side. It has a two different metal pieces in here so this can fold back. So let's say you just want to cover half of the window. This one can just tuck, you can, you can tuck back like this. You can do it like that. Or you can do the, the full amount there and it'll fit nicely along this. Okay, it has this extra fabric here that really is kind of going in almost every corner. It's pretty nice how it blacks out almost the entire window, almost every piece of the window. You can still see a little bit of sunlight through the sewing, but other than that, it, and it fits really good. It looks like it's staying up there really good. Let's get the other side on. Okay, and here's the passenger side. That one fits really well. Fit and finish is really good on that one. All right, let's work our way to the back ones, and then we'll do our roof panels. So here we are in the back seat. This is the uh, kind of the second row window, rolling window, and these windows kind of get smaller like this. So with this shape here, the cool thing is that they're they're really flexible, so you can really flex these into place. And then there's they have some spring to them, so they're going to stay in place. And then you just tuck the material into the corners, and it's really going to give it that privacy look. And the other side is going to work the exact same. And then, if we can see, if you can see right here, there's a little triangular piece. These go. There's a little window here on the very back. Okay, a little triangular piece. Okay, so here we are on the very back. This back hatch glass has a cover. It folds up as well. And you can see, like these, these can fold down to these smaller sizes. So you just give them a twist, fold down. You can put them in that storage bag. Always handy to have these in the car in case you ever need to, you know, really just kind of give some privacy to the windows. So with this one here, we just line up the notches. And you can see that that's covering the window quite a bit. And this is this is laying up, so even with this, this glass up, these, these panels are staying in pretty well. We shut this down, I'll show you a view from the inside. Okay, you can see there, blacks out that entire back glass. Okay, so the last pieces are the sunshade, the roof sunshades, and they're actually, they're marked rear and front. So because there's two different pieces, they have this reflective metallic 
fabric that's going to face the, 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 the top of the glass to reflect the sun. And then on the inside, it's going to be black, so it's going to give that, that black out kind of look. comes with these clips. These clips are going to help hold these up. So I'm going to show you how these clips work as we get these installed up uh, in there. Okay, so I'm getting this rear panel on, and there's these clips. The clips just hook onto the edge here and creates a flat surface that really slips between the glass and this trim piece here. So that just holds that up there. I've got one on the very back. That's going to hook into the into the back, and then I've got one on this side. Now this roof one, you could actually drive with it installed. These clips will hold it into place. comes with enough that I could probably put two on each side, two here, two here, and then same for this front piece. But this is really going to help reflect that sun, because this, this whole glass panel in the summertime lets in a lot of heat, lets in you know, a lot of uh, sunlight, so it's gonna help keep it cooler if you have this kind of set up like this. So with the back rear panel in, we're doing the front. This, so this is the roof panels here. These clips just go underneath and clip on underneath. We're gonna do two on each side. Okay, so with all of these clips on, two on the front, two on the side, two on this side, I'm gonna put this up into the ceiling, and then these clips are just gonna clip right underneath. There is a little gap between the, the, the glass and this trim piece, so they can just slip right underneath like that. And then on this side. Now in the middle of the roof, there's two panels, and there's a larger clip that holds both of the panels together, and it holds it nice and secure right against the roof so it doesn't rattle around or shake around or become loose while you're driving. Once this is installed, it makes this gap right across the ceiling nice and tight, no lights coming in, and makes it for a clean installation. Okay, you can see how bright it is. I mean, it's the middle of the day out here, and we're going to get up all of these these uh, window covers, and we'll see if it kind of blacks out the interior of the car. All right, there's just a couple little spots where some light's coming through, but otherwise, it's pretty dark in here. You could easily uh, take a nap in here, sleep in here in the middle of the day, and it not being a problem. So I'm pretty impressed with these. They fit really good, and they go up and down pretty easily as well. So here's just a shot of the outside, the reflectiveness of this uh, front windshield from the outside. So when you're ready to store these, they store away really easily. They fold up, so because they have that little slight metal band around them, they just fold up into a kind of a nice circle here. And then you can just tuck them down inside the bag, store them in there, you keep them inside the car, no problem, and then when you're ready to use them, you have them. All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching the video. Hopefully, you found this informational and helpful. Test Launch has a good product here. Uh, see the links down below. I like that these fit up into the window, into the windows very easily. They're compact. They're easy to store, and I like that there's nice reflective coating on like the windshield and the roof glass. So that way, you're gonna help keep the the, the car cooler. Anyways, guys. Thanks for watching the video. Be sure to hit that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, see the link down below, and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks.